Hey, I'm by Mark Johnson here, founder and creative director of Able Ape Studios, back again with another For the Love of Monday, episode number 28. So yes, uh, start of another week, so I hope everyone's off to a positive and productive week. Looking towards a positive and productive week, looking to make some things happen, get their hustle on, get their grind on, making it happen. So, uh, start of another week, you know, we kind of got the election and the Trumpness, all that kind of behind us, or at least we kind of got the road towards, um, you know, way it's going to be. It's kind of the way it's going to be for a while. Um, as for myself, my week is definitely full of definitely working on uh, the projects I always talk about. You know, I'll probably keep talking about them to the rest of the, to the end of the year, or at least until they're, they're completed. Um, it's just kind of the process, you know. Um, you know, and if you don't know, if you're new to the channel, if you're new to the, my videos, I am working on a children's book that I wrote, and I'm also illustrating, you know, and um, it's a gift for my uh, sister's daughter, uh, my niece, um, and uh, I think at a certain point I'll start showing some of these, you know, examples of what the, the, the imagery is, or the illustrations are, I'm just kind of going to try to keep it on the low, as, you know, as I'm building up to come towards the end. Um, the, the other project I'm working on is uh, a story, you know, a written story that I wrote again and that um, I'm actually on my second draft. So I'm going through and rewriting the whole thing so that I can get people to start reading, to give me some feedback. You know, I've done two previous books that, you know, are still in the same stages. They're completed, but I'm trying to get more feedback to kind of see where I can improve it and make the story better and um, continue on there. I think at a certain point, this will be something that is a completed package that I can use to, you know, either sell in my online store or, you know, just kind of just, you know, have something that I'm proud of that I was able to complete and that, you know, it started out with a simple idea. I was kind of involved or I got involved with a contest um, uh, writing for a novella and it started, started from there. I didn't know if I would be able to do it, but I was able to do that one and then I felt the story needed to continue on. So um, I continued the story with two more parts and so I'm on the third part right now. Um, outside of that, you know, I got another writing assignment for Video Maker Magazine. So, you know, I had one completed already, which is still a little bit pending. And then I just kind of picked up another one. So I'm starting to see how you can build streams of income that can basically, you know, you know you'll better your life. I've heard a quote that said that millionaires have about seven streams of income that they use to, you know, build their millionaire status. You know, it's not necessarily one way or maybe even two or three ways. It's kind of multiple ways that you can kind of do that. And so it's kind of, you know, uh, the mystery or the, 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 the store that I'm trying to create with my life is, you know, find these streams and I believe I found one. I just kind of got to work it out a little bit, you know, kind of get the entrepreneur mindset and kind of figure out a way to make that work. So I'm excited for that. You know, it's definitely going to be a full week. And as we go into, you know, holiday season, you know, I know the focus for most people sometimes can kind of get get lost because they're trying to, you know, do a lot of different things, especially focus on the holidays. And, you know, you got to get this, got to get this gift, got to get this gift for that person. person. Yeah, and, you know, so I'm trying to keep myself mindful of that. And at the same time, you know, once the holidays is over, it's you're in the new year. And so, um, if, again, if you haven't seen any of my other videos, I'm working towards you know, building, uh, you know, two to three, well, actually three to four year uh, goal plan, um, which is a thing that I had got out of a book that I recently read called um, Never Eat Alone. Um, and it's a story or it's a book about networking, how you can improve your networking skills and how to build your network. And in there, he's talking about setting goals. And so I use that as a framework to kind of start building that and so I'm also working on that and um, you know the week should like I said the week should be a full week um, I'm glad to kind of be in this position and um, I'm just excited to kind of you know see what the end looks like I mean each and every day I'm working on these projects um, visualizing the end I think that's something that you know most of us maybe don't do I don't know you know um, I know for a while there I was just kind of like focused on trying to get things done and not necessarily you know in the moments that you can kind of daydream a little bit, imagine what the project would look like at the end. So um, I'm excited to do that as well. Something that I would like to continue doing is a quote of the day. So today's quote of the day is, 
Think big and don't listen to people who tell you it can't be done. Life's too short to think small. So there you have it. Uh, quote of the day and I um, uh, hope everyone's up to a positive, productive week. If you like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. If you like what I'm doing the channel, definitely subscribe. And if you want to share with me what you got going this week, definitely leave that in the comment box below. And like we always do this time, have a blessed day. See you on the flip side. Let's go.